unprecedented. That's what people keep saying, isn't it? It's been an unprecedented season, an unprecedented time. And as annoying as it might be, as much as you might be fed up with that word, it's true, isn't it? It has been an unprecedented season and it's the same for youth ministry. Probably you found that. You might be thinking, oh, do you know what? It's been great. I've gotten to change everything because it's been so different. But for some of you, you might be thinking, wow, months of planning and relationship building seem to have gone out of the window overnight. But everything has changed. We've had to completely change the way we do ministry. And we're about to kind of pick up and go into a new season once again when we start off again in September. So today we've got a tool that's just really helpful as we reflect on what's been going on in this season, what do we want to keep and what do we want to change. And this exercise is called Start, Stop, Change, Develop. And I've drawn a beautiful picture here for you. So we've got these four areas, start, stop, change, develop. You can see what I've done there. What do we want to start coming out of this season? Maybe actually you found that in this season you've managed to go a bit deeper with those who were already committed, but you maybe feel like you've slightly lost those who are on the fringes. So maybe actually you want to start something up. Maybe it's a drop-in group. Maybe it's something a little bit more evangelistic. What is it you want to start in this next season? Secondly, what do we want to stop? Maybe, like the rest of us, you are zoomed out and with new regulations coming in, maybe you'll be able to meet again in smaller groups. So maybe it's actually you want to stop some of the Zoom stuff you've been doing. It might be something completely different. Maybe you want to carry that on. But what do you want to stop after this season? Next, what do you want to change? What actually might have been working really well for this season, but actually it just needs to change. Maybe it's the timing that you've been doing things. Maybe you've been able to meet during the day with your young people because they haven't been at school and now they are. So actually you're going to have to change that. Something's going to have to shift. And the final thing um, that we want to look at is what do we want to develop? Actually, what do we want to take forward? What's been going really well and actually we might want to add to that. Maybe it's that you've started bringing in young people to lead a little bit more within your youth group. Maybe it's the, just the structure of your meeting. You're thinking, do you know what, that's going really well. How can we develop this and get even more momentum going as we go into this next season? So the activity for today is just drawing this out yourself and writing down what is it you want to start for this next season? What do you want to stop? What do you want to change? And what do you want to develop?